What's up, everybody? It's your favorite Mile High Realtor, Aaron McCauley with Keller Williams Realty Urban Elite here. And this is at Altitude, and it is our Walkthrough Wednesday. So I am super excited to be here with Meritage Homes at their new Say Bell Townhome Community. This is an amazing property located in West Arvada, just like five minutes west of Old Town Arvada. And you guys, look at this view from the community. Um, not the greatest today because of all the smoke, but that, that is a beautiful view of the mountains, okay? And you are right here. I'm gonna step out just a little bit, kind of show you what the townhomes actually look like. So you can see that they're nice three-story brand new build townhomes. Uh, this particular community offers several different floor plans that you can choose from and we are going to be touring this corner unit here called the Crest Stone. Guys, it is gorgeous and I'm so excited to show it to you. All right, so we're actually gonna start at the back on the exterior. Um, the Crestone is the corner unit here. As you can see where the office is right here, that's actually gonna be your two-car garage. In this Meritage Home Sabel community, two-car garages are standard on all of their units, which I'm telling you for Denver in a new build townhome, that's very hard to come by. On the second story, you'll see is a gorgeous patio that actually sits off the dining and kitchen area. Be sure to show you that. And then on the very top here, this is one of the rooftop deck style homes that they offer. Now the whole community will not necessarily have a rooftop deck. As you can see, interior models such as this and these units, they will not come with those, which does drop the price. But if you want those gorgeous views of the mountains over there, then definitely this rooftop deck is for you. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and head on into the model now. Um, like I said, there are three different levels plus the rooftop deck, which makes it a total of four different levels of living space. So we're gonna start on the bottom with this gorgeous ensuite that could work as a perfect mother-in-law suite, a guest suite, or if you just wanna rent it out to make some extra money to help pay your mortgage. All right, so welcome home. All of their units are very tech friendly. They're all going to come with these state of the art electronic locks plus its own ring style doorbell system. All right, and we walk into the bottom level here. You can see here is your stairwell to get up to the main living floor. This door here is going to be how you get in and out of the two car garage that's attached and I can tell you I toured a unit that has a garage already built uh, but the rest of it is not finished. The garage is huge. It gives you probably an additional 8 to 10 feet at the front that you could use for a shop or if you have a deep freeze or an extra fridge that you want to put down there. And as we round the corner here you can see this is our beautiful first story guest suite. Um, now they do have this one staged as an office, which is a wonderful opportunity for you. But with these big, beautiful windows, this great size closet, and the ensuite, I think this would be the perfect mother-in-law suite. So let me show you the bathroom. Okay, I was geeking out when I first came into the bathroom, so I think you guys are gonna be really excited about it too. Um, so you walk in and you have this beautiful walk-in shower with tile and all new finishes, these beautiful glass doors. Uh, the nice thing about this is no matter if you need it for any kind of accessibility or you just prefer a shower, this is standard, is a shower on the first floor. Uh, of course we have the almighty toilet and then we have this beautiful oversized one sink cabinet here. Um, this is really great. I know it sounds funny, but in townhomes, especially newer builds, it is harder to find a cabinet that has the double drawers and the storage on the side. So this is a huge bonus that Meritage has thrown in just to make your life a lot easier in this home. All right, so coming from the first floor, we're gonna head up these stairs now to the main living area, and you are going to love this. All right, so as you can see, this is a very huge open floor plan um, with the living room, the kitchen, and the dining room all being on the same floor here. Um, just wanted to point out, this kitchen is one of three different types 
that they are offering. So the nice thing with Meritage Homes is that the design you see in the home is how it is coming. Um, they don't have this big design warehouse or anything that you have to make all these options and all of a sudden your price goes from, you know, 496 to 610 because of the finishes you picked out. What you see in the house and the price they have on the price tag that's it guys. So you don't have to worry about making all these design decisions or everything. You get beautiful top of the line luxury at an extremely affordable cost for a brand new build home without having to wait nine months or a year for it to be done. Because of the way they pick the finishes, they're able to actually turn out these new homes in a very fast amount of time. So it's well worth the money. So here is this gorgeous kitchen, plenty of storage space and this massive island. Now, they do just have it staged with four large bar stools, but honestly, you could easily fit five or six butts at this island if we needed to. And then I love this back here. This is your dining room. So it does have that beautiful kind of on its own room feeling, but it is still the open concept that is so desirable now. The great thing about this is it opens up to this gorgeous patio that I showed you earlier. So I actually wanna take you out on this patio just to show you how beautiful it truly is. As you can see, it's a great size. They have it staged with a table that could fit four. I think you could probably fit more or just simply put in some benches and chairs with little side tables and have a lot more room. But right now, this is your view. Uh, like I said, it's not the best because of the haze and the storm that's moved in over here, but all of this is views of the front range. In fact, this big black mass right here, that is the North Table Loop Mountain, which is a very popular hike in Golden. So you can just imagine waking up and coming out here every day to drink coffee and see that. The nice thing is, is this community is newer being built. So all of these are going to be townhomes. And then these units are actually single family homes that another builder is constructing. This is gonna be a huge master plan community, but the best part is you have this massive park with a huge pond and trails that lead to an open space on the other side of Ward Street, which runs right here. And none of this community has an HOA. That's right, it is completely managed by the city, so you have no HOA fee. So if you want to repaint the side of your house, or if you know your unit gets damaged by hail on the roof, you actually can just work with the city, and you would work with your party wall owners, which is gonna be the other townhomes, in order to you know file insurance for damaged siding or damaged roof. So that is huge, you guys. That saves you around $350 to $500 a month here in Denver, not having that HOA fee. Right off the kitchen, we do have a nice built-in pantry here that you're able to access. Same high ceilings as the kitchen and the living area. In here is your state-of-the-art tankless water heater, and then a nice size half bath for guests or yourself to use in this main living area. Okay, so now we're gonna head up to the third floor where all the bedrooms and the laundry room are. I'm obsessed with all of these bedrooms and I think you're gonna be too. Okay, so right at the top of the stairs around the corner here at the front of the unit is the master bedroom. Look at the size of this, you guys. These are huge tall ceilings with these beautiful recessed light. And this guy right here is just pre-wiring so you can put in a ceiling fan or another light fixture if you want. But look at all this light and this beautiful wall here where you could easily put your king size bed and this connected ensuite. So right here we have a private throne room. There will be a door that is installed here. They just have it off so you can see the toilet area, but can close off, which I'm sorry, I think is absolutely crucial <laughs> in order to keep a relationship together. <laughs> right here, we have this gorgeous oversized double sink vanity with a huge mirror on the wall. Like I said, this is standard. So what you see is what you get. This is exactly how your bathroom is going to look. Over here, we have a beautiful giant walk-in shower, kind of similar to the one on the first floor. However, the tile on the floor is also going to match the tile in the shower. Just really give it that kind of luxurious, over-the-top, gorgeous feel. 
And then at the back here is our massive walk-in closet for our master. Look at that. If two people cannot fit all their stuff in here, well then you got too much stuff. That's all there is to it. <laughs> Back out in the hallway, right off the stairs again, you can turn left and head this way. Um, this is simply a linen closet that you can use. Right here, because this model has a rooftop deck, this is actually where your furnace is going to be located. Um, you can hear it running right now, it's very quiet, so it's not going to be this disruptive, old, clunky system like in a pre-owned house. This is state of the art, guys. This right here, stackable full-size washer and dryer. Uh, keep in mind that the washer and dryer are not included with the home, so you would need to purchase your own for this unit. And then coming around the corner here, hi everybody, is our guest bath. Look at that. Nice big soaker tub, beautiful clean tile, and once again, this oversized double vanity with tons of storage. I know it sounds funny, I'm going to keep saying it, in Denver, especially in new homes, this is hard to find. You don't find storage like this. You find a double door cabinet and good luck on storing everything. And then of course, at the end of the hall, we have two secondary bedrooms, both about the same size, about 10 foot by 10 foot. Um, great because it's at the back of the house. So if you have little ones or guests that are staying with you, it's gonna offer some privacy and safety and protection for them. Um, but it's also separate from the master, so you don't have to sit there and listen to them playing or doing whatever they may be doing late at night. You have your own sides of the home. All right, so I am so excited to show you this last space. Um, this is probably my favorite part of this unit and I want to buy it so bad. Uh, but we are headed up to the fourth floor where the rooftop deck is. And I'm not kidding you, I have seen plenty of rooftop decks. I have been on rooftop decks. It's Denver, hello, that's just part of our nature here. This is easily top three best rooftop decks I've ever seen. It's gorgeous. Look at this. Look at this. So you come out here, you have this, which is part of your house here. It just kind of extends up. But then this, guys, I'm six foot tall. And this is just a little bit taller than I am. This is a privacy wall between your neighbor's rooftop deck and you. This is hard to come by. Let me repeat that. This is very hard to come by. Usually the walls are the same height as the balcony railing. And then you have to add some sort of privacy screen so that way you're not you know, being Tim the Toolman Taylor howdy neighbor with your people next door. No, 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 no. They thought about that and they put in this beautiful six foot tall privacy wall here. This deck, look at this, how they have it staged. A full outdoor sectional, fire pit with four chairs and a full six person dining table. And look at this view. Is this not insane? I mean, I'm, I'm not even kidding when I say that I want to live here. And I told them that I want to live here, but unfortunately I just don't have that money in my bank account right now because I promise you I would be signing on that dotted line so fast. So this is incredible, you guys. And like I said, the nice thing about all of these units is that when you come to look at whatever floor plan you like, they have several different options, as I've said, you get to see the finishes that will be in there. So it's not like a standard new build community where you're walking in and they're showing you, hey, if you're willing to spend, you know, 150,000 more than we have on the starting at price, this is what you could get. No, no. When you come to Merited Homes, Save Our Community, they're going to say, this is the price you pay and this is exactly how the unit's gonna look at move-in day. So this is a wonderful value. And if you want to come see it, please, please, please let me know because they are selling out so fast because these are incredible values. All of the homes so far that I have seen and that they've given me that are available to purchase now, under 600,000. That's unheard of for homes that are up to 2,200 square feet with four bedrooms, three bathrooms. Guys, this is a remarkable deal. All right, so that is the end of this week's Walkthrough Wednesday. I hope you enjoyed it. Next week, I'm gonna try and find something that is actually up there in the price range and is a single family home. So you can see what we have for beautiful new build townhomes that are extremely affordable, all the way up to something that maybe you're a millionaire looking for a palatial estate to call home. See you next week.